Now, if you want to talk about badasses in wrestling history, Haku is on the top of that list. Now, there's so many stories about Haku. Every wrestler was feared by him, even Andre the Giant. There's stories about how he bit off some guy's nose. Stories about how, like, there was a big bar fight. He was trying to break it up. The cops came and tried to arrest him, and he just pulled the handcuffs right off. Tore them off. Somewhat. So many different stories. Perry Saturn said in an interview, like, me, um, Haku, Ming, whatever you want to call him, his other name is Ming, that no other wrestler would stand a chance. Between Rick Steiner, the Barbarian, him, none of them would stand a chance. I mean, he was a bigger badass than Brock Lesnar, you know? Everyone was scared of Haku. Big badass Samoan dude. Part of Rikishi's family. Now, imagine this. He, he, was, he wasn't just a badass, he was considered a warrior, you know? He would destroy anyone. Now, maybe his wrestling career wasn't so great. He did wrestle Sting. He has wrestled big, major names. He returned in 2001, I believe, to team up with, with Rikishi in, tag, in the tag team division, you know. But Haku, if you look him up online, you'll just hear about all the stories, everything he did, how he was feared by everybody, you know. Now, I know a lot, a lot of people don't remember him too much. If you don't remember him, then that sucks, I guess. But... It's a name that not many people remember too well, but Haku, Ming, the biggest badass in wrestling history, the most feared man in wrestling. I now repeat it myself. I'll say it one more time. Haku, Ming, the most feared man in wrestling history. Let's look at his stories. That's all I want to say. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Subscribe if you want to. Ming is a legit badass. Don't mess with him. He'll bite your nose off. That's all I want to say. Thank you for watching.